Hey guys, what up? It's Chris TV here again today, and today I'm back with another Madden Mobile video on my channel. Now today's video, guys, is a very, very exciting one. We're talking all about Madden Mobile 21. What we know so far, what's going on, some screenshots you haven't seen so far, and everything like that. Some really exclusive content in this video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn my post notifications so you never miss any of my videos. Today's post notification shout out goes out to ChickenTube. Be the first person to comment on a video for the next video's post notification shout out. There's a stat on YouTube that says about 65% of you guys that are watching my channel are not subscribed. So if that's you, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my content. So, let's talk about Madden Mobile 21 in this video. So, if you saw my video yesterday and if you've been keeping up with the game and the news and everything like that, you can pre-register for Madden Mobile. It's actually not in the news tab. It was in the uh, news tab yesterday, but... Yesterday, we knew in the App Store, in the Android, iOS Store, whatever, everything, you were able to pre-order for Man Mobile 21. I made a video on that yesterday and everything like that. But some more news kind of came out yesterday as we saw a few lucky users um, get early access to Man Mobile 21. This is only available on Android right now. So double check if you haven't pre-registered for Man Mobile 21. Go ahead and go check and because there is a very small chance that you might have um early access so a couple users have been able to get into the game early they are literally able to download the app they are able to um they're able to just play the game i don't think it's the entire game um but on reddit nick messina said it is intentional and um he's not allowed to say too much about it and it's not the full game we do have some different info from some users that have had it. I have a few screenshots that I'm allowed to share here. And so let's kind of get started. So first of all, let's start with the screenshots from the app. So like things we already pretty much knew or we know. So we got four screenshots yesterday when we saw the app on the app store and we were able to pre-register for it. I'll just run through these real quick. Um, we obviously got the master series. We've seen this screenshot a few times before um, in the kind of the reveals and things like that that um, Messina has been streaming. We got a picture of the gameplay and season mode um you know you can see the scoreboard you got the snap ball same kind of vibe but the graphics look kind of cool we got actual players on the sidelines this year um look pretty cool right there and then we have a kind of a season idea begin your journey to the super bowl today got some things there and then we have a picture of like instant replay kind of vibe gameplay right there um which looks pretty cool as man mobile slay pointed out this morning in his video um you can see the cleats are definitely different there looks you know the, we see the white cleats on the Browns, which, which look super good. The purple on all the Ravens, once again, look really good. Um, so that's what we saw yesterday and everything like that. But here are, well, let's, let's get into some screenshots of what we see in the new game. And this is, like I said, you guys have not seen these before, um, but let's get into it. So, this is what you'll see when you get into the game. We got the Madden 21 Mobile. Welcome to Madden NFL 21 Mobile's preseason. Get ready to build your ultimate team. Um, I'm not exactly sure who this guy is. I got these screenshots um, on Discord. So, we've got solo, competitive, leagues in store. Same thing that we usually have, um, except, let's see, uh, my team and sets are not on that middle it looks like they're on the right as you can see kind of below that like uh the android button whatever you can see goals sets and teams so pretty much the exact same thing as we normally would see in the game right now what we've seen so far is very very similar to the game right now hopefully it's not the entire game i would yeah i would expect it not to be but you never know it's ea so it could be the exact same game just with a few small updates or whatever so let's get on to the next screen um let's do master series this is kind of the starting master series the first one's a julio jones um an 80 overall julio jones thing and then unlock different things. We see a Jalen Ramsey. Um, we see, yeah, so it's, it's kind of the same idea that we've had, you know, this past year. Um, this is just the screen of that. Then the next screen is going to be sets within the Master Series. Um, so if we look at those, once again, very similar, but looks pretty cool. There's that Lamar Jackson we've been talking about. We do know that when we start up the Master Series, you're going to get a, actually, let's show this, a 75 Lamar Jackson when you start. I will show you what he looks like right here pretty cool card art looking pretty cool i'm not gonna lie oh uh, yeah starts out as a 75 and as you go through master series you're not only getting the players but you're going to be upgrading this lamar jackson and that is what you're really trying to do here and as you can see in sets here you see the things at the top we got master series lockers they're back 
uh, a pro pack in the top right. Um, that's pretty interesting to see there. Um, then the upgrade 78, 79 onto the elite ones, the 81s, 82s, 83s, things like that. So you're gonna take some upgrades within there. So that's pretty cool for that Lamar Jackson. Uh, let's see, the next screenshot I want to show, I actually have only two more. I don't have a lot, but this is all we have. If you guys have any screenshots or anything, somehow, some way, please send them to me, and I can maybe make a second video like this. So this is kind of our goals uh, tab. And as you can see, we got a bunch of different things. we got daily goals, we got weekly goals, challenges, and achievements. So in daily goals, uh, we do have... Um, some of the similar things that we've seen, but we actually do have, it looks like better rewards in a way. Same thing, you're getting 50 stamina, you're getting some more coins, some, I'm not sure what those exactly are, the red thing on the right, maybe that's like battery packs or boosters, not exactly sure. You're getting XP and coins, complete any workshop core collection set, so maybe a few different ones. You scout to find a player, I'll talk about that in a second. Uh, complete a daily challenge, um, complete all daily goals, right now there's only six of them for the beta, whatever. Uh, a pro pack and 100 gems. So you're getting a pro pack for completing your daily goals, which is pretty cool. Uh, cl uh, claim a login calendar reward. So the login calendars are coming back. And then claim a Madden bonus offer. Uh, probably like the bonus store pack once again. So that's pretty cool right there. One thing I should note that I didn't say at the beginning of the video is... This is a beta, this is like a closed kind of beta thing, and it's meant for feedback so they can change things. So everything you see here may not be what's in the actual game. So that's just something to note. Don't take everything, you know, you know, it's not 100%. Take it with a grain of salt because it might change. The final screenshot here is, so let's talk real quick. So daily looks like we got some weekly goals now. Usually we've just had our like daily goals, feats, and achievements at the top, but now we do have weekly goals. Um, but then we also have challenges, and we know that uh, the mobile is linked to console this year, and we know that we saw the screenshot saying, you know, complete challenges on console and in Madden NFL Mobile um, to earn rep and build your cred and all that stuff. So I'm guessing that's how it's going to be linked through challenges here. You're going to have certain maybe gameplay type challenges to do, um, which is pretty cool. So to me, that's exactly what that is. I don't have a screenshot of the actual challenges, um, but I do have a screenshot of the achievements as well. Um, so it looks like the exact achievements that we had this year, um, like I said, might be different. Not sure, probably not. Um, the different tiers, you know, we see all completing all the feats. Um, same 10 offense, defense, special teams, men, bonus packs, and offensive yards. That kind of thing right there. So that's what we have with that. And that is just kind of the screenshots I have. One other I actually do have. Let me try to find these real quick. Okay, so EA actually made another gridiron notes. Um, if you know, you know, with all the, the reveals that they've done so far, they do gridiron notes kind of highlighting everything. But they actually came out with a brand new gridiron note, I believe, yesterday. And it's literally just pack odds. And it's there's no new information there. Just a couple quick screenshots. Um, just like we've seen in this year, we had pack odds for everything. So this is what we have right here. So first of all, we have a pro pack for the pack odds. And and Brick Squad, who is one of my subscribers and everything, mod my stream, did show me this and kind of talk me through this while we were in, while I was streaming last night. Um, but basically, for um, these pack odds are the exact same thing when we got a pro pack beginning of the year last year. So that doesn't mean that this is going to be the exact pro pack in the game this year. This isn't from, you know, anybody revealing anything. This is literally just um, a screenshot of from EA. So this could be different. They mu This might just be a placeholder because it, they already had the info from last year and... You know they're just throwing it here but it also could be what the actual odds of the new pro packs are which is the exact same as it was at the start of the year as you can see very very low chance to get a 70 overall player only a one in five and then one in about 20 to get a 75 plus but then again at the start of the year those players are very very expensive so um it can you can still make profit uh we don't really see much of anything we see some sort of offer in the bottom left kind of thing uh we see you know it has done does have uh kind of a madden cash i can't really make out anything of what that says i think it just has a bunch of id numbers or something like that so i can't really tell and then on the right we do see that coin offers and gem offers are still there for man cash 500 uh man cash for coins and then 500 man cash for gems i like that i think it's just a bunch of id numbers so we don't have any info or like numbers right now of how much you're actually going to get i would expect it probably to be very similar to what we have this year but this is this screenshot and then the second 
second screenshot is actually a program plus pack um, and there's not much here um, may contain a bonus 80 plus overall program player 14% you no know, blah, blah blah I'm not sure exactly what the program plus pack is but we do in the right have um, something we got a 20 pro pack bundle if you kind of zoom in there um, we got a 20 times pro pack bundle it's for man cash don't know the amount um, but yeah 20 pro packs right there so that's all I see there that's pretty pretty cool there now on reddit somebody who does have early access to the game did do a quick little review no other screenshots from him but like i said we do have a quick little review of um of what he's thought so far about the man mobile early access for playing about an hour or so before i'll put this on the screen right now he said players are exchanged for coins rather than training points not sure how this affects the auction house so this year you'd exchange a player in item exchange and you would get training points and front office points right now what they have it is exchange for coins so that's pretty interesting there um there are no captains in oh or no sorry master series is back but as part of it you improve lamar jackson we knew that there are no captains in overdrive instead you choose a scheme and a coach um we knew this from the reveal on monday madden today there are multiple steps involved in sets you earn badges which you exchange for trophies which you exchange for players i did see somebody else saying something very similar to this that it's a lot it's kind of you know um it's kind of more complex it's a lot more complex um, another big, this is kind of, we talked about this in the earlier part of this video. You send a scout on expeditions that take real time, and they come back with players and other bonuses. Expedi expeditions are two, four, or eight hours. Very interesting. Good. I'm excited to see what kind of, like, what this is. Don't know much about it. Uh, physics engine is different. Players move with more weight. Makes the game feel more realistic. On top of this, game looks great. The colors really pop. Catching AI has been improved. Um... Wide receiver, tight end, halfback, quarterback, and safety will attempt to make a catch if the ball is in their area. In drills like catch the ball in the zone, catch tracking is improved. I've been a single occasion where I've taken five steps before the catch registers. Not wrong. That's been a big issue this year. Here's the catch registers when the second foot is down. Um, I haven't come across any toe drags yet, but the way the game plays, I'd be surprised if they weren't well implemented. And then auto and open all buttons are still in use so that's what this user said and i've seen a lot biggest a lot of people are really complimenting the gameplay a lot of people are really liking the gameplay so far from madden mobile 21 which is cool um not my favorite part of the game i like the pack and the promo type but gameplay is cool as well um so that is all of the information i have for you guys what do you guys think about this so far and if any of you guys got lucky and got the early access please let me know because i would love to interview you or get some more screenshots maybe for a separate video and i'm sure more screenshots will come out as well in the next few days i don't know if i'll make like another video like this but we'll have to see um i just wanted to make this our first look at man mobile 21 here today super excited about two weeks away cannot wait thank you guys so much for watching this video if you did enjoy it make sure to like it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i'm the goose tv and i'm out i'll see you guys later